Hello, my name is Sean. This is in this video tutorial. I'm going to answer vague gamers question. Uh, I can create the grass textures things. Okay, I think I know what you mean. Uh, please correct me if, if I if I'm wrong. Um, so Unity has changed slightly the layout on the newer version, the 2020 version, 2021 version has changed slightly the layout on how to add textures. So uh, the moment I'm using the 2021 version 0.1, but anything above the 2020 version uh, will basically have exactly the same layout. So I'm just going to right click here on the hierarchy, select 3D object, and select terrain. So I have now added my terrain. You can zoom in and zoom out so you can see the whole terrain. So as you can see here, I have already imported the standard assets. If you have not done the standard, have imported the standard assets, what you will need to do is go to the asset store and search online and basically search for the standard assets. So make sure you have logged on to your account and then click on the standard assets. Then select open in Unity and then basically import them. I'm, just, I'm not going to import them again because I already have imported them. Now, if you do not see the asset store here, just click on the window and then select asset store. Okay. So now I have imported my standard assets. The first thing I need to do actually, in fact, is if I go to the console, I will be able to actually see the error message here. If you cannot see the error message, just try to play to run the project so you can actually generate the error message. And what you will need to do is put forward slash forward slash on line 11, forward slash forward slash on line 22, and forward slash forward slash on line 36 to comment these lines, which causing an issue. So I'm going to control S to save my C sharp project, minimize it, go back to my Unity project, wait a few minutes, and let's clear all the errors. And if I press play now, my project will run without any issues. Let's stop the project by clicking here. Uh, now I have my terrain in place. And here's the tricky part that Unity has actually changed. Uh, and hence to the question that I have received from more of my subscribers. So if I click on the brush, uh, I will be able to actually select Edit Terrain and then se select Create Layer. Now, I'm going to type here grass. I'm just going to select grass hill Alberto. And I'm just going to edit and select another grass. Create a new layer. Type grass. And I select hill. Right. So if I click on this option here, this is one of the things that they have changed. By default, is raise lower terrain from the drop-down list. And I think this is your problem. You, you wanted to actually put some textures. Uh, and again, correct me if I'm wrong. However, you're just raising the terrain. So if I drop down the list and select paint textures, I will be able to see now my uh, textures and basically change the color. Uh, if I scroll down, reduce the font, the, the brush size, select a different color there. And this is how you're going to do it. So make sure from the drop down list here, instead of raise lower terrain, you select paint textures. Now, if you want to add trees, so you click on the trees, you click on the edit trees, add a tree, and the add tree pop will come up. Now, one of the problems that people have is when they actually generate this window, they just click here on the little dot, and then they type the word tree. Now, the trees don't exist like that, okay? The trees have an actual name, like conifers and stuff like that. Okay, can you see here, conifer? Or if you want to find out what trees you have here available, just scroll down and you can actually see the trees that you have available. Okay, so let's select conifers, double click it and select add. Now I have added my conifers, I can edit the trees, add more trees, click on the dot and then let's bring up the other tree, click add, and then edit trees, add tree and then bring the next tree. 
and so on and so forth until you have all the trees that you want to have. Once you have selected the tree that you're happy with, then you can actually just click and drag to add the trees. You select a different tree, you are click and add, drag to add the other trees and click the next tree and you click to add the rest of the trees. If you want to actually, if we increase the bro size, you can actually add more trees. But just careful how many trees you add in though, because the more trees you add, the more rendering process you will need, the more CPU will, you will need, etc, etc. So I'm just going to bring the camera up a bit. So I'm going to select my camera. I'm going to select this option here. Raise up the camera, bring it closer to the center a bit. And, and let's use the tilt tool. Tilt here and the camera and then press play and I will be able to see now my, my world all right with trees so I hope that I have answered your questions vague gamer if you have any further questions or if anybody else has further questions please let me know thank you very much for watching bye for now